Hey, Toto, yeah, you know, if you hit a home run, hey, we'll pitch to you. <laughs> what the fuck? Who do? Who Maki, come on, man. It's my brother right there. How are you going to hit him in the face like that? Oh, my God. No. Why? Why you got to disrespect us? I really hates you. Why? Dog, I'm, I'm sick of this, bro. You got to respect Toto. Hope y'all doing well, man. It's time again for another Jujutsu Kaisen Friday. Your boy is here, ready to watch along with you guys. Like always, I apologize that I haven't uploaded for the past couple of days. I haven't really been active on anything. I actually recently got surgery on my ears, and they've been hurting like hell for the past couple of days. I got stitches right now, so I couldn't really put anything on my ears. I couldn't like put headphones or anything like that. I've just been chilling, just been vibing out. I know I still got to react to Rezero. I know you guys are gonna get on my ass about that, but I'm here today. We're gonna watch Jujutsu Kaisen today. Don't worry, I got you guys with the upload still. But uh, yeah, that's why I got surgery. So, you know, I believe this Jujutsu Kaisen episode is a baseball episode or something like that. I just remember seeing it in the preview. I, I mean, I guess it's gonna kind of be like a decompression episode because like, I mean, we didn't just come off of like a, like a basically like an exam arc. Well, like that's the thing. I, I don't know if this episode is part of the exam. I guess we'll find out together in a couple of seconds, right? But yeah, I absolutely loved it. Like, if this is starting something else, I absolutely love the, the exam arc that we on with like, we know Hanami invading and all that shit. You know, you guys saw my reactions already. You guys already know how I feel about that. It was dope. It was fire. I loved it. Gojo came through and everything, man. Uh, I've just been loving Jujutsu Kaisen. Absolutely fire, bro. I absolutely love this show. But yeah, guys, we've got to see what's in store for this episode of Jujutsu Kaisen. Make sure to subscribe and hit that bell, guys. It's super easy. Thanks like in one second. Of course, you guys can always change your mind later. Also, make sure to hit that like button. It really helps the board a lot. But nonetheless, let's get it. Oh, it's this dude. It's the dude with like the Titan marks on his fucking eyes, dude. Okay, is that Hanami? Damn, so she really survived that against Gojo. Okay. I mean, she's pretty injured. I'm not going to lie, but shit. Damn, that man Gojo really do be like, yo, I mean, that's what I'm saying. Like, I swear, like, why don't we just send Gojo, you know, to take out Mahito and all them, bro? I swear he can take them all out. All right, bro, chill, dude. This dude is creepy as hell. Mahito, if anything, use your idol transfiguration on this man, bro. So also, Mahito had the the finger, one of Sugina's fingers in the left. Yeah, okay, he's showing it right now, but... Dog, this man Mahito is really robbing us out here. So he got six of those fingers, and he also has this, like, cursed object. Okay, we back chilling on the beach again. I love that this man Jogo is like, yo, he has immortality. Is he stronger than Gojo? Like, they just, they hold Gojo so high up. It's like, dude, is he stronger than him? Rest in peace, Junpei's mom. Oh, okay. So like, this is like the planning before um, they did the veil on the exam grounds and whatnot. Yeah, okay. So it was kind of like a little bit of a distraction for uh, Ma Mahito to go ahead and uh, get all the, the fingers and whatnot and the cursed objects. That boy Sukuna actually hasn't came out in a while, you know? Like, I haven't really heard him talk or anything in a bit. I'm really loving the visuals so far uh, with some of these shots. They look really dope. God damn, of course they got to show this man Gojo's eyes, bruh. Oh, shit. Okay, so they got some big plans in Shibuya on the 31st, huh? I mean, I feel like they've been talking about this, uh, this event because I believe they mentioned it uh, before in the past. <laughs> God damn, Hanami. She really got fucked up, bruh. Hey, look at these best buddies right here. So I kind of like that right there. Uh, gave it a little bit more backstory uh, onto like their actual plan, you know, before they actually like uh, enacted the veil on the exam ground. It was more so kind of a distraction for Maito, obviously, to go get the curse objects and whatnot. And right now they're kind of planning this event or like something like they said, like, bro, we got to get the, the crew together, bro. Like I got I got some other curse users and all that shit, bro. Uh, you know, uh, on the 31st some shit's about to go down so i guess uh i don't know what day it is right now so i mean i guess we'll see all right bro i'm ready for some baseball even though i don't watch baseball i barely know anything about it but i'm ready man gojo just chilling bro oh they captured this dude the coat rack man this dude was talking mad shit i was about to say like dude there's no way you're gonna be able to take that man gojo oh shit oh they look pretty dope uh the kid with the the white hair and like that little like red highlight that look cool so gojo is a little bit stumped right now uh, by what they want with the fingers like they don't know like he doesn't know if they want 
to prevent yeah, Sukuna from getting more power or they want to enhance sushi. themselves, you know? The fucking trio right here, bruh. The squadron. Are they eating pizza? And see, now I want to have some pizza, bruh. See, this dude, Megumi, this, I fucks with Megumi on some heavy shit, bruh. Always showing respect. Like, I don't know, like, I just like Megumi. He's such like a good bro, dude. Okay, okay, he, he getting that rival reaction. He's like, yo, I'm gonna surpass you, but we also gonna work together, man. I <laughs> just dude, Toto. <laughs> this man, what the fuck? Where, where were you even hiding at, bro? Yeah, yo, Yuji, we gotta go, bro. Even this man, you just like, yo, bro. <laughs> I'm grateful. I fucks with you, bro. You gotta give me some some space. Oh my god, dude. Oh, dude, hilarious, hilarious. Oh, hey, it's Miwa. Damn, she got the okay. She kind of rocking the baseball uniform. I'm not gonna lie. I don't know. I don't know what this music is, but it's kind of bumping, bro. Yeah, exactly. Yo, Miwu was slumped while all this, all the real shit was going down, bro. <laughs> Her fucking sword. Oh nah. Ah uh, nah. I forgot Miwu was broke as hell too. Okay, baseball time. Also, this dude Gojo's always dripped up. Hey man, yo. Like I said, I don't know that much about baseball. I know. I think I know enough to realize what's gonna go on. But I'm just saying. I wonder. If they're gonna pull some type of like, they're gonna use their powers uh, during the baseball match. I think that's pretty cool. I, I kind of like when animes do that. I remember when uh, Dragon Ball Super uh, did that. I, I really actually enjoyed that episode quite a lot. So I'm really curious to see where this is gonna go. Right, so far it's kind of like a more. This episode is kind of like a little bit more like a, like a little bit more backstory. Like I said, you know, with, with Mahito and them, you know, planning the shit. Like I said before um kind of more like uh foreshadowing for the future this this event that's happening in shibuya um it's more uh comedy obviously it, it's basically like decompression decompression slash you know more foreshadowing and stuff like that which i really enjoy a lot which i really enjoy like i said i talk about this in attack on Titan a lot that like i love the episodes that you know they're kind of just talking explain stuff because it, it sets the foundation for what's going to happen later in the future so yeah i don't mind man also jujutsu kaisen it's funny as fuck, dude. So whenever they do comedy, I think it hits. So uh, let's just go see exactly what we're going to do with this baseball episode. <laughs> this man coach is like, yeah, a lot happened and a lot of people died. So uh, that, that's basically a big summary of this. This dude, Toto, bro. <laughs> Yo, Yuji scared as fuck of him. Okay, Toto, I feel you on that, bro. All that talk. I mean, isn't Toto, I mean, like, yeah, isn't Toto, like, I'm pretty sure he's the top ranked person right now, you know? Besides, like, Gojo, because he's, like, a, he's a first grade, right? Okay, so it seems that um, the baseball event is part of the exam. So that, that's what I was wondering. I wonder if it was, like, a little fun event, but no, okay, this is actually, you know, part of the exam. They gonna pick that baseball, man. I already know. But who picks it? To, oh, it was Yuji, okay. Well, that was easy. It was Gojo, huh? You're the one that did that. <laughs> this dude Gojo is a... <laughs> He's too funny. Maki, Maki pitch it, okay. Damn. That was just a fly ball though, yeah. Yo, this girl Momo, what's she doing? You're out. <laughs> I... <laughs> Yo. <laughs> I'm done, bro. Yo, I, like I said before, I don't know that much about baseball. I know enough to probably, you know, be able to play a game and shit like that. I don't watch it that often. This girl mama was right. <laughs> I'm done. I'm done. <laughs> She's just fucking running. She said, fuck it. When the balls hit, I run. Yes, Momo, that's all you need to do. Hit ball and run. Baseball, easy. Damn, Yuji, you don't gotta get real on me. Come on, man. Damn, Yuji. You said I wanna have people watching over me when I die. And Noritoshi having the, the anime flashback, dude. I have a really bad feeling that this man's gonna die. <laughs> he didn't even swing! Come on, come on, bro. You gotta do better than that. Uh, no, bro, not. Nah. No, bro, if you get clapped up in some baseball... Come on, bro. You literally swing a hammer as your weapon. It's a, it's a, it's a bat. Same shit. They not even gonna pitch Mekomaru cheating ass? Yo, Panda gotta hold her back! Okay. Nah, my. My Mekomaru cheating ass. Am I gonna Megu me up to bat? Let's go. Okay, bunt. Damn, dude. That man Toto was... You see that? Okay, come on, dude. That, that was a that was a sexy ass shot of Gojo right there. Why is the anticipation so high right now? Why am I getting stressed over some baseball? There we go. Good shit. Is a home run? Momo cheating ass! Oh my god! Momo cheating ass! Due to la bruh, bruh, really? I mean, I kind of felt felt like that was gonna happen anyway, but I don't know why I'm surprised. Exactly, Toto. Why didn't you pitch then? All right, Mekumaru. <laughs> Okay. Hey, Toto, yeah, if you hit a home run, hey, we'll pitch to you. Oh. <laughs> what the fuck? Who, do, who 
Maki, come on, man. It's my brother right there. How are you going to hit him in the face like that? Oh, my God. No. Why? Why you got to disrespect us? Okay, Toto, we'll carry, we'll carry your legacy. I really needs you. Why? Dog, I'm, I'm sick of this, bro. You got to respect Toto. I don't give a fuck how much you guys hate him, bro. Or you guys are roasting him right now. This man carried us. You know, when Hanami and them attack, we'd probably be dead if it wasn't for him, bruh. He's the one that taught Yuji the Black Flash, helped us with the boogie woogie and shit like that. Put some respect on this man's name. I, I don't want to see any... Plus, he's the he's the highest grade right now. He's the first grade. He's literally at the top. I'm pretty sure... Um, um, Nanami, right? Nanami's the first grade, too. So him and Nanami are kind of, you know, tied up. I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure Nanami's the first grade. If I'm wrong, fuck. But yeah, um... Dude, put some respect on Toto's name. We'd probably all be dead if it wasn't for him. You know what I have to say about Jujutsu's laws? Itadori, he chooses when he dies. That's what I'm saying, dude. Okay, my man's right here. He knows the deal, bruh. Itadori is very important. Okay, so they're still pretty on the fence a little bit with uh, Yuji and kind of what their plans are for him and whatnot and what they should do, but... That's kind of interesting. I feel like Toge with this would just be overpowered. Yeah, no time for regrets, only baseball. That's that home run right there, right? That's that out of the park right there, Yuji, huh? Momo's struggling up there. Yo, she cheating there. She, you can fly, Momo. How are you struggling catching some baseballs? Hey, we win? That's 2-0 right there, right? <laughs> this man Gojo is so disrespectful. This dude is so disrespectful, man. This was a really entertaining episode. I actually really liked it a lot. It was just... It was just pure fun, bro. I feel like Jujutsu can actually be a slice of life comedy. If it wasn't a shonen action, superpower, supernatural curses and all this shit. If, if Jujutsu Kaisen turned out to be just a slice of life, everyone chilling, having a good time, some good comedy, some shenanigans here and there, bro. I feel like it'd still be a really entertaining show. See this ED though? I know, look, listen, listen, look. I watch ReZero. I watch Attack on Titan, bro. I know damn well when stuff is happy, all this fun times, right? I know that there's supposed to be some tragedies. There's going to be some bad times coming up, man. You know, this ED right here, I still think someone's going to die. It's so, it, it's too sad. It's showing all the good times we'd had right now, hanging out with our friends. I feel like some bad shit's about to go down and that scares me because I don't want no bad shit to go down. I actually... I'm starting to really connect with a lot of these characters, man. Like, I really like them a lot, bro. Rice or bread? Rice easy, bro. Rice easy. Who, who would you... Well, uh, bread is pretty good, too. Wait, isn't this the same shit, bro? This is the same... <laughs> okay, okay, they flipped it, though, with Panda right here. I was about to say, like, bro, this is, like, the same the same Jujutsu scroll as last time. Rice, though, over bread. Okay, we driving. Oh, someone's dead. Maito! The see you! Megumi, see, this is what I'm saying. Episode 22, the origin of blind obedience. See, this is what I was saying, man. Look, in the preview, I I'm seeing blood. I'm seeing people die, dude. That man, Megumi, Mahito back, bro. This is what I'm saying, man. Like I said, dude, as soon as there's happy stuff, I just know in the next episode or beyond the horizon, there's about to be some bad shit going down, some tragic stuff. Don't think I forgot about what happened to my man Junpei. RIP, rest in peace to my brother right there. What well, could have been? That man could have joined us, been friends with us in the Jujutsu school. But nah, that man Mahito had to turn him into a damn Pokemon with that idol transfiguration. So yeah, dude. Uh, I guess in the next episode, Megami got to do some stuff. It said the origin of blind obedience. Don't know what the fuck that means, but... Mahito right now, he has six of the fingers, I think, and he has, uh, like, the cursed object. So I'm really curious to see exactly where it's going to go with this. I'm really curious to see what happens with this event in Shibuya on the 31st, man. But I really enjoyed this episode of Jujutsu Kaisen. Really nailed all the, the comedy aspects, the life aspects, the more foreshadowing, all that. Really solid episode from JJK. Hope you guys enjoyed this as much as I did. I, like I said, I just thought this was a really fun episode and just really entertaining overall. Make sure to leave in the comments down below what you guys thought about it. Also, make sure to subscribe and hit that bell, guys. It's super easy. It takes like one second. Of course, you guys can always change your mind later. Also, make sure to hit that like button before you head out. It really helps the board a lot. But nonetheless, it's been Evo Avery, and I'm out. Peace. <laughs>